This is I Am Free in the key of D, and I am going to just play this simplified tutorial for you, teach it to you, have a lot of fun. Uh, make sure to stop the video, and if you click on the description below, I will have the printable chord sheet that'll make a lot more sense as you print it out and follow along. All right, so in the key of D, we have D, G, A, and then we have a B minor, so it's a pretty simple one. Let's go through and find those chords. If you look for kind of our landmark of the group of two black notes, you will find a D tucked between those. Line up your five fingers and then play this F sharp in the bass. So you play D, sorry, F sharp in the middle, I should say. D, F sharp, A is a D major chord. It's a triangle shape if that helps kind of see that shape. Okay, and then our G chord move down here it's tucked between the group of three black notes this is a g chord line up your five fingers g b d and then if we move up to one set of notes you'll find you're in the a position and just pick up that black note in the middle again we're going to play that same triangle shape a c sharp e okay makes that triangle and then our b minor is the trickiest chord of them all so you're going to play B, D, F sharp, okay? And it kind of makes this curve line, those three notes, okay? So let's review those. We have our D triangle, G, A triangle shape, and our B minor. I like to use fingers one, two, three. You can use whatever fingers feel comfortable for you, okay? All right, so left hand is gonna be playing single notes. We're just gonna keep it simple down here. I'm gonna line up um, pinky on G and line up my five fingers for this song, and then you don't have to move your hand the whole song. So when we play a D chord up in our right hand, we're just gonna play D, a single D note down here. Okay, G to G, A to A, and our B minor to B note in the bass. All right, so the rhythm that we're gonna do to bring the two hands together is called, uh, it's four or four time signature. So I use a rhythm called one to two ratio, or it looks like this. Together, right, together, right, together, right, together, right. Practice that on the G chord. Together, right, together, right, A chord. Remember that's a triangle in your right hand. So that's the nice marching rhythm that will bring the two hands together. I'm gonna sing the first verse so you can see what it sounds like when we add in some vocals. All right, here you go. Through you the blind will see. through this bum, 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 bum. and you can slow the rhythm down you could just go bum. you could go like this if you want to have less beats through you the blind will see through you the mute will sing okay then we shoot to the g chord there through you the dead will rise through you all hearts will praise b minor through you darkness flees through you my heart screams i am d chord free okay it's just kind of a nice simple marching rhythm and then chorus goes like this and i am free to run i am free to run okay then we move to the g chord i am free to dance together is too complex for you feel free to just drop that left hand go through the chords just block cording them so just go i am free to run i am free to run i am get 
into position for the next chord. Free to dance, I am free to dance, I am B minor, live for you, I am A, live for you, I am, and then back to the D, okay? And then add in that rhythm when you feel comfortable. And like I said, you can kind of just do it that slower rhythm like this. Through you, the blind will see. Or you can add in some a little bit more uh, fast tempo there. Through you, the blind will see. Through you, the mute will see. G. Through you, you know, and so on. All right, I'm going to play it beginning to end. You can go back to the beginning if you need a little help. Otherwise, grab the chord sheet, have a lot of fun, lead somebody in worship, or just, you know, for your own enjoyment, sing along. Mm -hmm. 